Hey guys, Robbie here at RV Sales of Oregon. Um, excited to show you a uh, Georgetown by Forest River today. Um, great rig, awesome owner, super good guy, took really good care of it. Uh, let's check this puppy out. Um, like you'll get on a lot of these Class A's, you do have a lot of storage through and through. No need to look inside, but you can see right in. There you are. Uh, same base size here. Um, you have power here as well in there. Um, you'll see in the back you actually have your pass-through storage since this is a gasoline rig Your engine is up front. So good pass-through storage, whatever you might need to be keeping in there anything longer like that um, you know, perfect, for, perfect for your trips, but let's check out the living area in here um, One thing you will want to point out is nice big awning to have out here. So you have a hang area um, these awnings above the slide outs that you can see there are actually their lifesavers just over the lifespan of the coach. Uh, they're going to save you on leaks, things like that. You know, saves you money and they don't look too bad themselves. All right. Um, I'll tell you what, one of my favorite things they've done with this coach is the flooring that was done here. Um, I, I'm really happy they've stepped away from the whole carpet. It's just a whole lot cleaner. I know when I'm camping, I'm not staying that clean most of the time. So just a nice setup here. Um, you have your captain's chair there. Uh, it's spinnable, so you can just kind of be at home as you drive along. This is a Ford Triton V10. Um, you know, very solid engines. Um, the guy that had this took really, really good care of it. Um, he used it the right way. Um, did not want to sell it. He did not want to sell it, but uh, family stuff happens and it's here now and it's ready for someone else to enjoy. Um, good size counter space, um, lots of storage in here, up top, convection, and your regular oven. Let's see, I haven't checked this out too much. Just lots of good storage. Deep storage under the sink, all those needs. This here is buckled. You can legally ride here as you drive and you do have a pullout bed underneath to sleep extra, which is not really a problem with this rig is sleeping extra. As we move to the back, you'll see what kind of sets this rig apart from a lot of the other ones is it has a bunk space here. So if you're traveling with kids, family, um, you have the extra sleeping area. Um, these are hard to find. It's hard to find something that's gonna be um, the class A with a bunk like this and this size. So this is awesome um, Now if you like this rig and you don't want a bunk nice thing about this is this is an easy removal And there's just about a million things you can do with that space. However, you choose to use it um, Let's walk this way. I'm gonna show you the commode um, Spacious, you know, you can uh, definitely stretch out a little bit when you're uh, doing business I'm uh, about 6'2 not huge, but it passes the armpit test. It's always a big one for me. Um, and then you do have a walk around bed back here as well. Um, they really did good with the spacing in this rig. Um, you can walk around while there's still a bunk there. Um, nice size dressers here. Um, sorry, little things in there. But you can hang things there. There are hooks there to hang his and hers or hers and hers, however you choose to do that. Good size pull out drawers. That's all the way through here, um, through all these. Um, you do have your privacy from the bunks. If you wanna get away from the kids, just slide these and you're done. I'll let you imagine how that works. And uh, let's see. yeah, I like it. <laughs> Well, cool. Yeah, and you do have the uh, fridge. It runs on LP. It runs on electric. Um, just simple stuff. You know, it does everything you want it doing. I mean, this is this is the traveler's rig. Um, you know, and, and we're going to be real aggressive uh, selling it. He uh, he needs to get rid of it. He said for, for some family stuff. So so give us a call. Uh, make us an offer. We'll make you a deal. Uh, make sure to ask for me. I, I know the rig and the owner really well, and we can work out a good deal for you. Um, thanks for taking the time to check this out with me. And uh, we'll talk to you soon at RV Sales of Oregon. We'll talk to you soon at RV Sales of Oregon.